Hey guys, this is Senator Troy Singleton, and I'm so thrilled to be reading one of my favorite books with you today. Dragons Love Tacos. And it's Tuesday, and everybody loves tacos on Tuesday. So I want to make sure I get a chance to read this to you. I really wish we could be there together in person as we've done in the past. But unfortunately, because of this COVID pandemic, we have to stay safe. But we're still going to have fun reading. So let's buckle up for Dragons Love Tacos. Hey, kid, did you know that dragons love tacos? They love beef tacos and chicken tacos. They love really big, gigantic tacos and tiny little baby tacos as well. See that? See that? Why do dragons love tacos? I know why I love tacos. Why do you love tacos? Really? Yeah, I love them too for that reason. Maybe it's the smell from the sizzling pan. Maybe it's the crunch of the crispy tortillas. Maybe it's a secret. Either way, if you want to make friends with dragons, tacos are key. Hey, dragon, why do you guys love tacos so much? Can everybody see it? Here we go. But wait, but wait, as much as dragons love tacos, they hate spicy salsa even more. They hate spicy green salsa and spicy red salsa. They hate spicy chunky salsa and spicy smooth salsa. If the salsa is spicy at all, dragons can't stand it. No salsa on the tacos for the dragons. Why do dragons hate spicy salsa? Well, just one drop of hot sauce makes a dragon's ears smoke. Just one single speck of hot pepper makes a dragon snort sparks. Spicy salsa give dragons the tummy troubles. And when dragons get tummy troubles, oh boy. If you want to make tacos for dragons, keep the toppings mild. Tomatoes, check. Lettuce, check. Cheese, check. These are all good toppings for tacos for dragons. All right, see that? So make sure you get your tacos right for those dragons. Hey, dragon, how do you feel about a spicy taco toppings? Dragons love parties. They like costume parties and pool parties. They like big, gigantic parties with accordions and tiny little parties with charades. Who here plays charades? Anyone? Charades? Anybody? Okay. Why do dragons love parties? Maybe it's the conversation. Maybe it's the dancing. Maybe it's the comforting sound of good friends laughter. See? There we go. The only thing dragons love more than parties or tacos, you guessed it, come on, taco parties. Taco parties are parties with lots of tacos. If you wanna have some dragons over for a taco party, you'll need buckets of tacos pant loads of tacos. The best way to judge is to get a boat and fill the boat with tacos. That's about how many tacos dragons need for a taco party. After all, dragons love tacos. Hey, dragon. Yo, dragon. 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 Are you excited for the taco party? Yeah? I thought so. Okay. Check it out, guys. Just remember, dragons hate spicy salsa. Before you host your taco party with dragons, get rid of all the spicy salsa. In fact, bury the spicy salsa in your backyard. Now, this is a little note. Do not take your parents' salsa and then put it in a backyard and bury it. That probably won't go well. Let's just make sure we just don't put it on the tacos for the dragons, all right? All right, cool. Bury it in the backyard. Remember, we're not taking our parents' tacos, salsa, and burying it, okay? So the dragons can't find it. These dragons love your taco party. They love the music. They love the decoration. They especially love the tacos. Congratulations.
It's a good thing you got rid of all that spicy salsa. Wait a second. What? What are those green little things in the salsa? You didn't read the fine print? Oh no. Oh no. Oh. It says now with spicy jalapeno peppers. Dragons, 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 dragons. Listen to me. Do not eat those tacos. Do not eat those tacos. Those little green specks in the salsa, those are jalapeno peppers. They are super spicy. I know you love tacos. Dragons, I know you love tacos but you're not going to love those tacos. So please do not eat those tacos. Do not eat those tacos. Oh no, I think they're eating the tacos. I don't know about you, but what's going to happen next? <sighs> Too late, you guessed it. Told them not to eat the tacos. I said, don't eat the tacos. Y'all heard me say that, right? You heard me say, don't eat the tacos. So it looks like the dragons burned our house down. Now, why would dragons help you rebuild your house? Maybe they're good Samaritans. Maybe they feel bad for wrecking it. Maybe they're just in it for the taco breaks. After all, after all, dragons love tacos. The end. Hey, gang, this has been, again, an honor and a privilege to read to you uh, that once again, my friends, this is Senator Troy Singleton. Hopefully next year we'll be able to be in person and be able to sit in front of each other and do this as we've always done in the past reading stories. During Dr. Seuss Week, it's important that we share our love and joy of reading. So don't stop reading because a book can take you anywhere in the world just by flipping a page. Take care and I hope you have a great rest of your day.